one Game of Thrones character who looks set to find himself in a spot of trouble is Jon Snow, played by Kit Harington. The King in the North has a tough battle against the Night King, Vladimir Ferdic, and his army of the dead ahead of him when the show returns. And it seems Jon will die in the process of trying to take down the hit HBO series villain in order to save the people of Westeros. The latest theory suggests Jon will plunge his Valyrian steel sword, Longclaw, into the Night King whose body will burst into pieces. But in a shock twist, he will reform, revealing that neither Valyrian steel or fire can stop him. Following the revelation, he will return to Dragonstone with his lover Daenerys Targaryen, Amelia Clark, who is expecting his child. They will learn from Melisandre, Karis Van Outen, the Night King can only be defeated by Azor Ahai, who must sacrifice his one true love. Melisandre will then be executed for her past crimes but dies peacefully knowing she has revealed how the army of the dead can be defeated. Daenerys will insist Jon must kill her but he will refuse and head to King's Landing once more with Jaime Lannister, Nikolai Costa Waldau, to try and convince Cersei, Lena Headey, to help with the fight but they are arrested. Outraged by the plan, Daenerys marches her army to King's Landing and threatens to attack the city if Jon is not released. Jaime urges Cersei to listen to Daenerys, but she refuses and chooses to fight the Mother of Dragons instead. As a result, the King's Lair ends up strangling Cersei but with her last dying breath, she orders Jon to be killed. Reddit user Mrs. Alansit goes on to explain they believe Daenerys will discover Jon's body and be sent into a fit of rage, ordering everything around her to be burnt down. They continue, once in front of the Iron Throne is sitting on it, Daenerys will finally get herself back together and will realize what she has done, cue the vision at the House of the Undying. In this moment where her guard is down, from the shadows will appear our reborn, backstabbing hero, Littlefinger, killing the Mad King's daughter with his Valyrian steel saga thus saving the inhabitants of the capital. It comes after assistant director Jonathan Quinlan appeared to reveal the release date for Game of Thrones Season 8, sharing a snap on Instagram, in which he thanks those who worked on a huge fight scene at Maramorn, he dropped a huge spoiler. It read, when tens of millions of people around the world watch this episode a year from now, they won't know how hard you worked. His note appeared to hint the final series would air next April. Game of Thrones Season 8 is expected to air on Sky Atlantic and HBO in 2019.